Hello YouTubers, Rob here. So, uh, brew day today, Sunday, and um, I've been demoted down to the cellars where the wife wants me to brew from now on, not in the porch. So I've got my temperature controller, that's been keeping me, uh, my boiler going, turning it on every now and again. A little bit hot, to be honest. This gets up about a degree and a half hotter than that, so uh, I've just dialed it down. The mash was up about 67 and a half, so I pulled that down to bring it in line with about 65 and a half where I wanted it. To 66, you can see it's been recirculating using the cheap six pound fish pump, quite merrily. The fish pump sits down the gap there, the tube pumps it round, it spins around quite merrily. Very even distribution. You can see now the bottom, that's quite actually deep. That's a good a good few inches deep. And it's uh you can see right to the bottom of that. So I'm happy that it's it's cleared and does what it should do, and the temperatures are good as well. So yeah, fingers up for the uh thumbs up, not fingers up, thumbs up for the Circulating pump. Now what we're going to do, this is up to now 77, so we're going to lift the lid, put the pump in there, lift the bag out, and uh, start that bit. So I'll just pause it and we'll come to that now. Yeah, so uh, my Subaru is just around the corner there, he's escaped. Uh... So yeah, we've lifted this uh, bag and bucket up, we put it on the sieve, we've got the holes in the bottom here, obviously fitting through the grain bed anyway. And then we just put in the, uh, the water pump on. You can see it's just recirculating on the top there quite happily. And uh, pulling it from the little thing here. So it's only a very cheap little fish pump. I mean, that element was on a minute ago, so <laughs> it's pretty hot down there, I'd imagine, but it's coping. Plastic's not melting. A little bit. But yeah, I'm happy with that. It seems to be doing the job. Water catching at the bottom. Happy days.